Hi guys, welcome to Stumpy Grump Scale Speed Shop. This is Craig, and I'm going to do an inbox review today on the Monogram Corvette Z06 Dream Rides Kit. It's a 2004, according to the instructions, Corvette Z06. This is one of the Ollie specials that they had uh, a little while back for $12.99. So let's get the camera turned around and get going on the review. All right, so here's the box. Let's go ahead and jump right into this one. The instruction sheet, this is billed as a 2004 Corvette Z06. Not gonna really go into the instruction sheet. Here's the decal sheet, some underhood decals, gauge decals, a couple of Corvette scripts, Corvette logos, some interior stripe decals for your door panels and your seats, a couple of Z06 logos, and some license plates. Not a lot there, but enough to help you detail it a bit. We'll jump into the plastic here. We have separate door panels. We have seats and seat backs. You can see some engraved, molded in Z06 logo on the seat and the headrest. That's part of your front air dam. The interior tub where the door panels are will go with the engine bay and hatch all molded in nice looking looks like you can do some nice little paint detailing on that to help pick it out we have a bunch of engine parts and such it's your intake your belts heads exhaust manifolds your accessory front there, front of the engine. Radiator and cooling fans. All your induction system. Your oil pan. Nicely molded, nicely detailed. Liking that. We go to the chassis and the suspension area wheel hubs here's the engine with the drive shaft and the transmission kind of wild how they have that set up with your transmission actually in the back by the rear end some suspension parts again good looking crisp molding got a little bit of lettering there that has to come off licensing licensing statements that they have to put on everything so I kick the camera here you have a dashboard the dash cover more suspension parts the exhaust wild looking exhaust how it comes out like that your front and rear suspension pieces just nice engraving nice molding nice details not a lot of flash either a little bit but not much and we go to the last little bit here we have some fender wells Looks like a little bit of the firewall, obviously the hood, some more engine pieces, fluid covers, reservoirs, shifter, emergency brake, brakes and caliber, steering wheel, mirrors, pedals. Not bad, I say, not bad all around. Here's the glass. 
a clear glass. Obviously, you have to paint the black on the outside of those marker lights and stuff. Gauge panel cover. Tail lights and such. Very small chrome tree, as you would expect. Mirror, interior mirror, these are your outside door mirror. And the four wheels, that's it. Not much chrome on new cars anymore, which is okay. Good looking wheels. Look how open they're molded. No flash, no extra plastic on those. Looking good. And we go to the body, which also includes the tires. Your low profile. No name tires, no name on them. Maybe expect a good year, but nope. No lettering at all. Nice looking tread. Good looking tires. And like I said, the body. Your logo molded in. The Corvette script molded in. On the back. And there's another logo on the trunk. Your door lines are not very deep. I would be grooving those out anyways, but not very deep. So probably gonna have to be careful deepening those, grooving those out. So your, whatever you use your panel line tool doesn't skip out of there the windshield and the rear window every all the all the windows install from the outside molded in windshield wipers so not bad looking you know a lot of you might not be interested in the newer cars and stuff like that and the corvettes but this looks like a pretty nice kit for $12.99 at Ollie's. Um, I mean, let's face it, usually you can get a 15% off coupon too off of your purchase. So you're looking at less than 12 bucks for a kit, even if you're not really interested in it. It looks like a really nice kit. Uh, looks like it. Again, looking on it. What do you got? 116 parts. So pretty detailed too. You can see there are all your reservoirs. You just do some different shades of black and such to, to really pick them out and separate them from the rest of it like that. Got himself a pretty nice looking kit probably. Pretty fun build looks like too. Looking forward to doing this one when I finally do it. Not really sure when or what color. I have two of these actually, so got to pick a couple of colors for them. But anyways, thanks for watching. Stumpy Grump Scale Speed Shop. This is Craig saying I'll catch you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe.